treatment of alpha-1 antitrypsin deficiency, AATD, depends on the symptoms and severity in each person. COPD and other related lung diseases are typically treated with standard therapy. Bronchodilators and inhaled steroids can help open the airways and make breathing easier. Intravenous augmentation therapy, regular infusion of purified, human act to increase at concentrations, has been recommended for people with established fixed airflow obstruction, determined by a specific lung function test. This therapy raises the level of the AT protein in the blood and lungs. Lungs. Lung transplantation may be an appropriate option for people with end-stage lung disease. Liver transplantation is the definitive treatment for advanced liver disease. When present, paniculitis may resolve on its own or after dapsone or doxycycline therapy. When this therapy does not help, it has responded to intravenous augmentation therapy in higher than usual doses. Doses. All people with severe ADD should have pulmonary function tests every 6 to 12 months. Those with ATT serum concentrations 10% to 20% of normal should have periodic evaluation of liver function to detect liver disease. People with established liver disease should have periodic ultrasounds of the liver to monitor for fibrotic changes and liver cancer, hepatocellular carcinoma, carcinoma. Yearly vaccinations against influenza and pneumococcus are recommended to lessen the progression of lung disease. Vaccination against hepatitis A and B is recommended to lessen the risk of liver disease. People with that should avoid smoking in occupations with exposure to environmental pollutants. Parents, older and younger siblings, and children of a person with severe ADD should be evaluated to identify as early as possible those who would benefit from treatments and preventive measures. Of measures.